and we go and get to the VIP or all of these girls come around the VIP and they just be standing there and like, let me tell you something, man, I'm going to get back with you. We got to rewind this back. We used to go to the, when we go to the club, we used to have these bottles, right? And on this bottle, they'd be, they'd be regular Moet bottles. On them bottles right there, they'd been to have something to make the girls be real, real slippery and all of this kind of stuff. So when you get up, they'd be like, don't touch them bottles right there and only drink them bottles right there. So we already knew what the drill was. You just don't mess with them bottles, right? Then all of the girls is in the club after a while. They all running, look, opening up their mouth like little birds. He's running around just popping pills in their mouth. Pop, pill, 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 pill. And then that was the party. I used to, I used to, you know, we used to be on the road. You know, you'd be like, yo, let me go over to my puff room and see what they doing. And you knock on puff door. He'd be sitting there damn near butt naked. You ever just had a grown ass man answer his hotel door butt naked and they'd be like, come on in. You'd be like, mm, I'll come back. Bro, put some clothes on. What are you doing? Walk. I don't want to see you naked. Grown man stuff. Yo, that's kind of disrespectful. So when you get, that's, that's called the test off. How you make sure you breaking in. Yo, call, call the artist up here to the room. Tell them I'm going to have a meeting by my tub. He be in there by the tub and stuff, soaking and stuff. But at neck, you be like, how the hell am I supposed to have a meeting with a nick butt neck in the tub? Yo, so we back in here for another edition after your mother. And it seems like these old niggas just don't know when to shut up. Like now, this nigga named Mark Curry. Used to rap a bad boy. I've never heard of this nigga. I guess he was on the bad boy for life song. I've never. Like, okay. He had one guest appearance. I've never after that heard of this nigga since. And he's one of these rappers that's early 50s. Look like he about 67. Coming back later on trying to throw Diddy under the bus talking about he had artists come to his hotel room naked while he was in the tub. And he, he saw Puff put pills in bitches mouths after they spike the bottles of Moet. Sir, that is actually like literally dry snitching on yourself. If you had knowledge of this and didn't inform authorities, they come back and charge Puff, they're gonna charge your stupid ass also because you was in direct knowledge and cahoots with a person that was quote unquote spiking drinks of women he was trying to have lewd and lascivious contact with, which means that could also get you indicted. You stupid, sir. And coming back later on trying to tell on a nigga, it's gonna backfire on you. This is what I'm talking about. All these old niggas that think that they, they ain't thinking. They just you put a microphone in front of them. They so stupid they'll just talk, even at the detriment of dry snitching on itself. And sir, at this point it will behoove you to shut the hell up. In any event, if y'all like this episode, subscribe, turn the notifications on, like, comment, and share, and I'm out. No.